आज ही डाउटनेट ऐप डाउनलोड करें डाउटनेट पर होगा अब आपके सभी मैथ्स केमिस्ट्री फिजिक्स और बायोलॉजी डाउट का सफाया बस अपने क्वेश्चन की फोटो खींचो उसे क्रॉप करो और तुरंत वीडियो सोल्यूशन पाओ डाउनलोड नाउ In a certain sequence of numbers, each term after the first term is the result of adding two to the previous term and multiplying that sum by three. If the fourth term in the sequence is one eighty six, what is the second term? Option one two, option two four, option three eighteen, and option four sixty. so we have been given a sequence of numbers such that uh such that the term after the first term would be obtained by adding 2 to the previous number and then multiplying it by 3 that means if p denotes the previous value and n denotes the next value of a sequence then previous value in the previous value when we add 2 and then multi uh, multiply the sum by 3 we obtain the next value of the sequence now it has been given to us that the fourth term of the sequence that means the fourth term of the sequence this term has been given to us as 186 and there would be more terms in the sequence so on So the fourth term is one eighty six, and we intend to calculate the second term. So if this term is n, that means the next term, we can calculate the third term using this relation that has been given to us. So if we simplify this, we can use the backward substitution to find out the value of p. So from here we find we obtain that p. that means the previous value can be obtained by dividing the given value by 3 and subtracting 2 from it that means the value that has been given to us we have to divide it by 3 and then subtract 2 in order to obtain the previous value then similarly for this number we can apply the same procedure to obtain the second value now since the fourth term is 186 so the third term that means the previous term can be calculated as follows 186 divided by 3 minus 2 so 186 divided by 3 gives us 62 minus 2 that is equal to 60 so that means the third term is 60 so similarly the second term would be the previous term that means the 60 divided by 3 minus 2 so 60 divided by 3 which gives us 20 minus 2 is equal to 18 so that means the second term of the sequence is 18 so from the given options option 3 is the correct answer class 6 to 12 se leke neat iit je hi mains aur advanced ke level tak 10 million se zyada students ka bharosa आज ही डाउनलोड करें डाउट नेट आप या व्हाट्सएप कीजिए अपने डाउट्स आठ चार सौ चार सौ चार सौ पर